is OneDrive the same as SharePoint? That's the question. Now, the reason people want to know this is because OneDrive looks like SharePoint. If you look at the URL, it even has SharePoint in the name. And if you're used to SharePoint from the on-prem days, you'll know that OneDrive used to be called My Sites. So the truth is, OneDrive uses SharePoint technology at its core. That's why it looks like SharePoint. That's why it has that URL up there. But OneDrive's not the only thing to use this. Teams does this as well. Any file stored in Teams is going to use SharePoint to store those files. So many different applications in the Microsoft 365 world all use SharePoint. It is a good platform to start building things, whether it's custom solutions or additional Microsoft products. So there's a lot going for it, and that's why you see that kind of technology being leveraged in a few, in a few different ways, whether it's OneDrive with a pure files experience or Teams with an almost pure collaborative experience or SharePoint bringing together the files, the collaboration, and site pages to build out intranet. Who would have thought SharePoint was going to be the key to everything back in the SharePoint 2010 days when the experience was less than ideal? To sum this up, is SharePoint the same as OneDrive? Absolutely not. Their similarities, one is based on the other, but they are entirely different products. While you're learning more about OneDrive, check out this video that I made talking about big problems that can happen if you're not using OneDrive correctly.